Welcome to the City of Bakersfield Planning Commission meeting. This television broadcast is made available through cooperation with the local cable companies, the County of Kern, and the City of Bakersfield. The Planning Commission meets on the first and third Thursdays of each month. You can watch the rebroadcast of this meeting Saturday at 7 p.m. and Sunday at 10 a.m. The planning meeting agenda is posted on the city's website at www.bakersfieldcity.us. Presiding over today's meeting, Chair Larry Komen. Uh, good afternoon. It is my pleasure to call to order the October 7, 2021 Planning Commission meeting. Madam Clerk, would you please call the roll? Commissioner Komen? Here. Commissioner Lomas? Here. Here. Commissioner Bashertash? Here. Commissioner Biddle? Here. Commissioner Bowers? Commissioner Cater? Commissioner Wade? Thank you. Uh, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready pledge. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, we have we don't have a crowd today, so we can skip right to uh, yeah, we'll skip right to public statements, and there are none. Uh, Mr. Cater, okay, we're we'll just go right through the line. Uh, we we did the number two, the pledge of allegiance. Next, Madam Clerk, next item is public statements, and there are no public speakers. So we can move on to next item, please. Agenda item four, consent items. Thank you. All matters listed under the consent items do not require a public hearing and will be enacted by one motion. There will be no separate discussion of said items unless staff or commissioner request specific items be discussed and or remove for separate action. We have a little voting thing here on our screen. Was that supposed to be here? Mm -hmm. I'll just put the X. Now I'll mess it all up. I'm gonna be against that, whatever that was. How's that? Pardon? <laughs> Okay, so uh, getting back to this now, uh, may I get a motion to approve the consent calendar items? This is the minutes from the 9-16-21 Planning Commission meeting. I'll make a motion. And Commissioner Cater, may I have a second, please? I'll second that. And Commissioner Biddle, thank you. Uh, Madam Clerk, Yes, we need a vote. No, not yet. Is it showing? Is it showing? I do not see it here now. No. I think I voted yes already. Not. We'll do a roll call. <laughs> Commissioner Komen? Yes. Commissioner Lomas? Yes. Commissioner Bashertash? Yes. Commissioner Biddle? Yes. Motion passes with Commissioner Bowers. Oh, oh excuse me. Sorry, Commissioner was... Cater. <laughs> Don't show up two minutes late. Sorry. Uh, and I vote yes. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Motion passes with Commissioner Wade and Bowers absent. Thank you, next item please. Next item, consent public hearings, item five.
There are none. There are none. Yeah, I was saying there are none. What we, okay. So there are none. Okay, Madam Clerk, next item, please. Item number six, non-consent public hearings. Okay, now is the time for non-consent public hearing items. Before we begin, I want to explain how each hearing will be conducted. Staff will first give a report, then those in favor of the project will be allowed to speak. Those in opposition to the project will be allowed to speak after all those in favor have spoken. Each side will be given five minutes to provide rebuttal comments. Individual speakers may ask questions during their statements, but the questions will not be answered until the public hearing on that item is closed. Written comments may be given to the clerk who will provide copies to the commission. Please be respectful of others participating in the hearing by not repeating the remarks of previous speakers and presenting any new comments or thoughts in a concise and clear way. Mr. Johnson, would you please provide us with your staff report? Thank you, Chair Coleman. Good evening, commissioners. Welcome to the member of the audience. Glad you're in attendance. This item is a conditional use permit for a skilled nursing facility. It is located uh, near Gosford and Harris Road, um, just south of Gosford Village or the Sam's Club. The project is approximately 63,000 square feet, containing 99 beds. The average age of the clientele will be 65 years. The average length of stay is 28 days. The facility will provide 24-hour personalized care that includes but not limited to wound management, stroke recovery, therapy movement, social integration, and engagement. This project was reviewed by the Site Plan Review Committee as shown on the screen, and they reviewed it for compliance with uh, city development standards. Um, therefore, there are conditions associated with this project, and those are recommended as part of the resolution that's attached to your staff report. We also did public notification and received no public comments. Uh, for conditional use permits, as a reminder, there are two findings that your commission needs to make. The first, that is deemed essential and or desirable to the public convenience or welfare. And the second, that it is in harmony with the various elements and objectives of the general plan. Staff believes those findings can be made with the conditions, as I previously mentioned in the resolution. Therefore, based on what I just mentioned, staff is recommending approval of conditional use permit number 21-0153. This completes the presentation and available for questions. Thank you, Mr. Johnson. The public hearing on this item is now open. Is there anyone who wishes to speak in favor of the project? If so, please step to the microphone, identify yourself, and proceed. Is there anyone, seeing none, is there anyone who wishes to speak in opposition to the project? If so, please step to the microphone, identify yourself, and proceed. Seeing none. Does any commissioner have any questions for the public on this item? Remember, this is not the time to express any opinions on the matter, it is only time to ask questions. Okay, seeing none. Uh, no speakers after rebuttal, no rebuttals. All right. Okay, I will now close the public hearing on this item and return it to the commission for comment and action. Any commissioners wish to speak? Does anybody would like to make a motion? I always hit the wrong button. I'll make a motion to approve. I'm sorry? I'll make a motion to approve. Okay. Second. That was a... Uh, a motion by Commissioner Biddle and a second by Commissioner Bashertash. Uh, Madam Clerk, you know, please have a vote. However you want to do it. If I 
Is it, show, is it showing up? I'm sorry? Is it showing up? It is not, not showing up. Okay. And I'm not saying it's you. I'm saying uh, I don't yeah. see it. So yeah. it could be a number of things. We will do a roll call. Okay. Commissioner Komen? Yes. Commissioner Lomas? Yes. Commissioner Bashertash? Yes. Commissioner Biddle? Yes. Commissioner Cater? Yes. Motion passes with Commissioner Bowers and Wade absent. Thank you, Madam Clerk. Next item, please. Next item, agenda item seven, communications. Does staff any, have any communication items? Uh, yes, thank you. Our next meeting will be October 21st. Uh, it will um, go a little bit longer than the last, this meeting and the previous meeting. So uh, I just urge that you read the staff reports when they come your way. If there's any questions, uh, we can be prepared to answer those. Thank you. All right. <clears throat> Madam Clerk, next item, please. Next item, agenda item eight, commission comments. Do any commissioners have any comments? Okay, seeing none. Madam Clerk, next item, please. Next item, item number nine, adjournment. All right, we stand adjourned. Thank you.